Hi everyone, it's your girl, Hey Planner Girl. Hey, welcome back to another video. And today I'm gonna to be sharing with you my deco planner using a A5 Midori notebook. So grab a snack and come on back and let's see what's inside. So you're probably wondering what is a deco planner? A decoration planner means I have taken all of my planner goodies and I have placed them in here. So, well, not all of them, but you know what I mean. Um, I've subscribed to so many kits over the years. I have lots of different, you know, deco, you know, washi and things, stickers and you name it. And then I just don't know what to do. And I can't just like throw it in a planner. I don't know why. It's, it's something I have like an issue with that. I don't know what it is, but anyways. So I decided um, once I started art journaling in my little memoir planner, I started to think, wait a second, I can probably use a lot of this decoration stickers and things like, as I'm pulling things, you know, things like this and, you know, maybe, yes, of course I can use these in spreads and stuff, but like, I would love to reuse them and put them in a spread or if there are sticker books there is a variety of stickers in here that I'd like to just kind of see in a spread so anyways let's get into it so I made a vinyl with my name Soulistic that is my like personal name ever since I started blogging and stuff so I've always just kind of kept it I used to have a graphic design website and I used to you know, make people websites and do graphics and stuff. But anyways, so now I've, I've always kept the name. So I decided to make this planner called Soulistic. If you, you'll see in some of my other videos, I have this one, which is my wellness planner. It says my soul, and this is Ruhi in Arabic. And then this is my name, Candace. And so I have a bunch of Midoris. So let's get into it. So first of all, my name page i'm not minimalistic at all this is all honeybee shop all here every single thing except except for the this washi this washi and this one planner society not sure anymore and then i think this is michael's it's a holographic washi so yeah so let's get into it so here's a journaling card i'm just going to name drop things honeybee shop it says if the crown fits and now that you understand what I mean, you can see, like, I have these stickers. And wh what am I going to do? I'm not going to put them on my skateboard, okay? <laughs> so I want to keep them tied close to my Midori. And so there you go. I did a, I'm a big Simpsons fan, did a Bart Simpson Supreme sticker. You know, I'm sure I did a haul with the Simpsons stickers. You can take a look at them. And so... It's like a shoebox game kind of thing. It's it's really good. <laughs> okay, over here I have some um, deco stickers. This is Alice in Wonderland. They are these stickers from a long time ago from eBay. I bought a bunch of them. They came in these like plastic packs. They're called sticker flakes. Long, long, long time ago. I've had them for years and what a perfect setup. So this is an Alice in Wonderland quote, but I nearly forgot. You must close your eyes. Otherwise, you won't see anything. <laughs> Alice. And then here is some kind of just deco going with the vibe. This is a, these are some like streetwear, um, Chinese, China, Beijing, I think it is. I'm so sorry. I should have really written this down, but I love these um, fashion street models and it's always paired with some sick music so there's Jawe I forgot his name but he's so he's so cute he's so cute here is some washi stickers I got a long time ago they're so pretty paired with some gold foil and then just pulling in colors and you know kind of making a mood a huge deco mood board Here's that beautiful retro purple, purple core, purple city vibes, all that. I love it. Over here, 
Uh, we are dead and even under the same sun. So some of these quotations and journal pages, I, I, I was inspired by a lot of Instagram girls. So some of the quotations came from quotation Instagram pages or Pinterest. So that's where I'm finding it from. Mm. Sorry, my, <clears throat> my throat. And then, yeah, same things. Just like quotations, but just pulling in some confetti and things like that. I don't know why I have this sticky note here. <laughs> That's not meant to be here. I think maybe I want to save it for another sushi spread. So I have all these sushi stickers from, um, from Omi Momo. I think I'm, I think I'm butchering that for sure. Uh, Umomo, which is a store here in Toronto. And so I just pair that with like some sushi washi over here. Some more deco. This is the song from Miley Cyrus. I love the song Malibu. I love it so much. And then again, just some more deco stickers I have lying around, some washi tape, some things that I printed out. And I mean, it's just awesome. Again, those sticker flakes. For the life of me, I couldn't get rid of them. And then there you go. <laughs> over here, these are some OG stickers since I started planning a long time ago. Not sure why that's there. Um, like I'm talking eBay times 2012, like a long time ago, or even like more earlier than that. And so again, the sticker flakes, and I think they ju they're just paired so well. They're just little stamp seals with little deco inside. Again, those washi stickers and some quotations. I love, I love Casey Musgraves. Um, and yeah, a lot of this is actually lace and whimsy and some, some washi stickers. These were all downloadables. So that's what I got. I'm subscribed to her patron, patron. So that's what happened. Let's move on. Some more deco. And I don't know, I hope this inspires you. You know, if you have stuff that you're just sort of like, I don't know what to do with it, I can't just plop it down on a planner. This is an inspirational page as well. Again, just pulling out some colors, kind of scrapbooking, decoing, sort of making a art journal zine going on. Um, lots of lace and whimsy here. I forgot the singer's name, but she's so cute. And I'm really vain, kind of reminds me of myself. So that's there. <laughs> I love this actress. She is from, oh, what's the name? It's from the HBO Euphoria. Yeah, from Euphoria. And one day I saw this on Instagram and she was rocking the Von Dutch. And I was just like, what? She's bringing it back? Like talk about old school. And um, she's eating a pretzel, which is probably one of my favorite things. <laughs> um, here, Casey Mus uh, Graves. I hope I said her name correctly last time and then I found this like deco girl on Pinterest and um, I have to give a shout out to Vixie plan she's really kind of made me realize wait a second you can go online and print stuff out and so um, I found her on Pinterest and I think she's so cute and she kind of blends in really well and this all just kind of came to be I didn't purposefully you know look for this look for this like I just I don't know I just had stuff in my little um, scrapbook box and then here is just some like internet vibes follow your arrow one of my favorite songs I love her outfit when she was on the I want to say the Grammys or the American Music Award I think it was the Grammys but her outfit was just so adorable my first zine from Lace and Whimsy I'm so stoked was it this one? Oh no this is the one I missed out on but this is the one I wish I got I have her other zine, her second one. I actually have it right here, sitting here for some inspiration. Just, and you're actually supposed to cut all this stuff out and like put it in your planner, but I don't want to. <laughs> I want to keep it just like that. Again, some more quotations, some washi tape. Oh my gosh, I got this. I won a, I forgot. I think it was the Great Canadian Sale. 
Canada sale, but I won um, a credit to this girl's shop and she had these washi samples. I love this washi so much. I actually finished it. Anyways, so I don't know what I'm going to do here yet, but that's there. Love, oh my gosh, I love brats, dolls. And so, um, I don't know, I just love this picture. I found it on Pinterest and I just collaborated some weird washi, which is my jam, with the picture and I just love it. All of these are stickers that I had in my collection. Again, same thing, just kind of pulling color schemes and meshing them together. This was, this was like completely so random. Like I'm a big Sailor Moon fan. And so I found this picture of Saturn and I loved it so much. And then I realized I have these space stickers and it flows so amazingly together. This is from Pip Sticks all around it. And I was like, oh my gosh, this is, this is rocking. Magic Potion from Sticky Club. And then just a quotation. It is actually a song. I suck. I don't remember the artist, but if you type in Magic Potion song, you'll find it. Um, again, this washi had it for years. All of this washi. And just never really... I mean, I dabbled in it, obviously, but like I, have, I haven't really used it. So it's just really nice to pull washi, you guys, and put it down. Same thing. Stickers. Just use it all up. Um... This is from the Happy Planner, the glam book. I'm not too sure what I'm going to do here yet, but this is the vibe I'm going for. I love pizza. Mm. So there's a cute girl and some pizza because I love that. This is a great movie. It is called The Love Witch. You guys should check it out. And the vibe is stellar. And I'm going to try and post um, the Instagram girl that I love. I think it's Ruthie. Ruthie is her name. And she did a spread of love potion and she just inspired me. So I, I, I grabbed the same screen caps that she did and stickers from Lace and Whimsy. And then I just made my own little thing and I'm just so in love with it. And I just, I'm, I like look at it and I just feel so good. Like I've used washi, I've used my stickers in between and I just feel really good about it. And it just makes me really happy. <laughs> Okay, these are some, like, tripped-out stickers I got a long... Well, no, I, I shouldn't say that. It, not, it wasn't a long time ago, but I, I got this in a pack. And sort of random, right? Very random. So anyways, I just kind of pulled them all together and made a spread. This one I kind of wish I put in my memoir journal, my art journal about myself and everything about, like, me. And um, I'm going to reorder these stickers, actually, these cassette tapes, and I'm going to make the spread again because it's just kind of like going down memory lane. And I love cassette tapes. I remember buying them all of the time to record off the radio and, you know, and then I'd listen to stuff. Here are some stickers from the Sticky Club. Same thing, right? So I, I have the stickers and I'm like, I just don't want to put them anywhere in a spread. So I just made my own little Purple City Vibes. I printed out some pictures and I just stuck the stickers on and washi tape and I feel really good about it because you know like I said I just don't want to stick them anywhere I know that sounds really terrible but it's true it's sort of like having your own sticker book it's like a, an art sticker book here's another one I'm so sorry this video is like rambling but I appreciate you staying <laughs> um, Fresh Boba Tea. She's my jam. Love her art. And then the stickers here from the Sticky Club. And they all just kind of go together. This was a little bit of a wellness check, which was sort of like, you know, like loving rave music. What it's, what it's like being in music. You know, I don't know. Okay, this was super random too. I printed out this picture because she's hella cute. And then I stumbled upon these um, color scheme, like, uh, hexagons in the happy planner and I think it came out really really well this I stumbled upon as well on Pinterest and I don't know it's just kind of like I don't know just kind of I love the picture and so I I just like took the screen grab and I collaborated it with some washi stickers and I just love the art it's very artistic 
Here is Lace and Whimsy. I love her own little quotations. This is from actually her Instagram. Be your own bestie. And I was just like, wow. You know, you are magic. Um, I love all this. Honeybee shop washi and stuff like that. And so, yeah, I just pulled it and I made a little art collage in respects to um, Lace and Whimsy. And just like everything. Looks so good. Again, tribute to the brats dolls and then i stumbled upon this on pinterest i'm pretty sure you're like you're like internet explorer no one likes you lol it's kind of sassy here again i got these stickers from um the sticky club and it's the same thing i just don't want to stick you i want to keep you kind of like in a section so i did a little art journaling um with some washi stickers and it just looks so good i love it it's very calm to flip through. Some more washi stickers. And then this is probably one of my favorite songs um, as well with the lyrics. I have a lot of favorite songs. But anyways, this is just the few that have made the entry. Save Your Tears by The Weeknd. Oh my gosh. Like, I love it. I love that song. I love the lyrics. They speak to me. So it's really good. Um, again, sticky club and deco stickers from like Amazon, these firework stickers. And I think it just, it's so awesome. Like I love turning this page. It's a vibe, right? It's very Instagram worthy, I guess. Um, that's going to be one of my goals for 2022. Just take better pictures, uh, on my Instagram. Okay. These are those like boba tea deco stickers drink stickers and again i just didn't know what to do so i decided you know what i freaking love just looking at them so i just took them all i literally went through the whole thing and i peeled off all the ones that i loved and they're all on this page i'm gonna probably put a, a quotation here these as well these are sticky club stickers they are all uh witchy girls in a window so I really loved it. I'm so sorry. I should have probably been zooming in the whole time, but um, I think it goes really well. I'm going to put a quotation here, maybe here. Just, ha just haven't gotten around to it. Put some sticky washi from, some sticky washi, some washi from the honeybee shop. Um, and I just really liked it. And again, I just didn't want to put the stickers anywhere. Some blue cloud vibes and some stickers. And that's pretty much it, my friends, for my art journaling so far. As you can see, I have a little bit of stickers here. What is this? I don't even know. Oh, some of that. So that's what I'm doing with my stickers when I do a haul or I show you what I get or a new, new washi tape or anything like that. I make a art journal. I Don't get me wrong. I put it in my planner, but like... If it's stuff that I get and it's like super random like or like just really pristine and I would never want to just see it kind of be hidden away forever I would love to I'd love to put those kind of stickers in here those stickers that I don't want to be hidden forever because I just want to be able to go back and I appreciate everything I get trust me I appreciate everything I purchase and I stumble upon but like some things and just like I love you so much, Umbrella with the stars. <laughs> like, I want to see you in my planner. Oh, and if you're wondering, this is all those um, Fisker scissors that I have cut out, which is, which is what I love in my little art journal because I can just kind of like scrapbook. It's like scrapbooking, but like art scrapbooking. I don't know how to describe it. I don't know what this is called, but I love it so much. I hope it inspires you, my friends. I hope it brings you some joy. I hope it gives you some ideas um, on what you can do if you have like a favorite sticker or washi. I know there's lots of planner girls who have a book just filled with washi samples that they've ever owned. I used to do that and then I couldn't keep up with it. I probably should have, um, but yeah. Anyways, I hope... That was super cool. If you like this video, don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks so much for coming by. And I will obviously, if I do any more, I will add more like parts to this video. So I'm just going to name this part one. And I'm sure there will be many parts to my deco Midori. So anyways, have a super fun day, everyone. 
Bye. And thanks for coming by. <laughs> In that not order, but you know what I mean. Okay, bye.